What is up everybody, Lynn Ray here. Um, this is a, I guess a, a second part to my, my vegetarian or vegan vlog that I did back in September, November, somewhere around there. So it's been about six months since I made that video. And uh, in that six months, I've made some pretty, what I would consider pretty good progress in my, in my journey towards being a vegan or vegetarian, pescatarian, whatever, whatever it is I decide to be at this point. So uh, at the time that I made the video, I think I, I was on my, on my way to, or I guess on my path to becoming a, a vegan. Uh, at this point in my life, that is no longer what I am, what I'm moving towards. So I'm still on that path towards the, obviously the healthier eating style or eating habits, healthier eating lifestyle. And so let's see. So during that time, I was I was eating. I was pretty much consuming only fruits, vegetables, uh, fish, and turkey. Turkey every now and again. Probably turkey once a week. I think at that point, uh, once or twice a week. Um, but since then, I have I have fallen off the wagon. I think I did have uh, chicken maybe once or twice since then. That was due to just circumstances, you know, living circumstances. It was just too easy, the temptation, all that that BS. But uh, but maybe that was only maybe like one or two times. Uh, but for the most part, well, not for the most part, but I have only been eating for the last I would say maybe two and a half three months I've only been eating fruits vegetables and fish so I guess at this point I am almost like a hybrid right I'm like a hybrid of being a vegan and vegetarian so for those that don't know basically the difference between being a vegan and a vegetarian is uh, veget excuse me vegans don't eat any animal products any anything that is derived from an animal Whereas vegetarians don't eat meat, right? So they only eat beef, pork, chicken, um, turkey, you know, any, any animal, right? But some vegetarians, they still do eat like cheese or they'll consume milk, right? And so, so that's kind of the, the big difference, I guess in a general sense, that's the big difference between the two. So vegetarians will have some animal products, cheese, milk, eggs, uh, whereas vegans won't have any animal products. So I'm kind of like, a, I guess I would still be considered a vegetarian at this point, uh, but I'm kind of a hybrid. So I, I don't really eat cheese. I don't drink milk. Um, I do have uh, fish and I have eggs, right? So, so my, the, the, the basis of my animal products are, you know, fish, eggs, and that's about it. Uh, I don't, like I said, I don't eat fish. I mean, excuse me, I don't eat cheese. I, I don't know. There's something about cheese. I don't even like the taste of cheese anymore, which is kind of weird. So, so I guess I'm, I'm still considered a, a, I would be considered a pescatarian, right? Um, and so, and I'm happy being a pescatarian at this point. So maybe, maybe later on down the line when there's more, when the whole morality thing starts to hit me a little bit more, uh, I'll probably venture into that vegan thing. But right now, you know, I don't want to get all into that, but, but right now I, I am a pescatarian and, uh, and I feel good doing this uh, or being a pescatarian. Also, one of the things, you know, this is kind of a little health vlog in general, I guess. One of the things I've been implementing, and I did it before maybe a few years ago back when I was in college or, yeah, back when I was in college, I, I did it back then as well. But I've been, been doing intermittent fasting for the last uh, two weeks, two weeks or so. So I, I have been tracking my, my calories, just kind of what I've been eating throughout the day, uh, which isn't, if, depending on who you, who you talk to, that's not really part of intermittent fasting. Um, some people say intermittent fasting basically is eating whatever you want during a certain time frame and fasting for the rest of the time. So I, I still do that, right? I, I eat during a certain period of the day, usually between 11 and six or 12 and six, just depending on how I'm feeling that day. And then I don't eat after that time frame, uh, but uh, but I do count my calories. So for the most part, I've been eating around 3,000 calories a day, which is uh, which is fine for me. I, I like feel good. I still I go to the gym every morning. I, I work out. I get a good workout. I you know I, I come home and I work all day, and then I do a little studying, a little coding and stuff like that, and uh, and and I feel I feel fine. So 3,000 calories is sufficient for me. Um, since I've been doing this intermittent fasting, which has been about maybe a week and a half, two weeks now, 
I have lost about six pounds. So I don't know, in my last video, uh, well not my last video, in one of my previous videos, I talked about me living in my car and then me eating junk food and, and garbage. Uh, during that time, I actually gained a whole lot of weight, you know. And uh, since I have been doing this intermittent fasting, I have actually lost all of that weight plus some. So I weighed myself yesterday, I was 234 pounds. Uh, this morning, I was 230, 36. I had a little, I had a few, I had a candy bar, not a candy bar, a, um, a Fiber One bar yesterday, um, which has, you know, uh, which, is, which is heavy in fat. And so, so anyways, I had two of those yesterday. But, um, so this morning I was 236, I think it was. But, but yesterday I was 234. So 234 is probably, 234, 235 is probably about what I weigh. I drink about a gallon of water each day. And so, so you know, a gallon of water I think weighs like eight pounds. And so, so that could, you know, obviously help, you know, make my weight fluctuate a little bit uh, here and there. But, um, but yeah, so I, you know, I'm, I'm on this, I think right now I'm very comfortable being, being a pescatarian, right? I'm comfortable eating fish and I don't eat fish every single day. Honestly, I've only, in the last two weeks, I've eaten fish once, twice, maybe three times, three times in the last two weeks. Uh, so it's not, it's not a daily thing for me. Uh, but, uh, for the most part throughout the day for the last two weeks or so, I've eaten pretty much 90, 99% fruits and vegetables. And, uh, and it's working out well for me. I feel good. You know, I'm, I'm losing weight. My, my abdomen, I'm, I'm actually seeing my, uh, I'm losing the kind of the bloat that you have. Uh, sometimes as you age, it's, it's kind of weird for us guys, as we age, you know, we, we start to gain weight around our midsection and, um, yeah, and I'm losing all of that. Like I, you know, I pretty much have no bloat around my midsection now. Oh, also <laughs> a little TMI here, but, uh, since I've been doing this intermittent fasting thing, all right. Close your ears if you don't want to hear this. But since I've been doing this intermittent fasting thing, I've been going to the bathroom a lot more. TMI. But um, going to the bathroom a little bit more. And uh, and that's nice. <laughs> you know, it's it's nice. It's funny when I was, when I was you know, back a long time ago, when I was a meat eater, you know, when I was a big meat eater, I would sometimes, uh, you know, I would sometimes go to the bathroom maybe like three times a week you know, which isn't enough, right? Sometimes two times a week, sometimes one times a week, just depending on the week. So I was, I was very much not regular, but, uh, <laughs> it's kind of weird talking about this to random to, you know, to everybody, but, but, but since I've been doing this vegan thing or excuse me, this vegetarian thing, definitely on the throne a lot more. And since I've been doing this intermittent fasting thing even more now, so it's weird. So, I say one of the benefits of intermittent fasting is, is your body gets time to rest. Your body actually has time to recover and, and do its job. So you have this one phase where you are, your body's working, right? And so it's, it's doing what it's supposed to do. And then it has this phase where it's, it's just kind of at a, at a state where it doesn't have to work. It's, it's got time to recover, recuperate. And so I think that's, you know, for me at least, I'm finding that it's a good thing. So my body is actually working and uh, I'm going to the bathroom a lot more. I feel better. Um, I feel lighter. <laughs> uh, and I probably, I'm, I'm sure that helps with the bloat around the stomach. So for you guys who, who, um, who have that bloat around the stomach who are noticing that, maybe try intermittent fasting, you know, and again, you know, I don't, I'm not going to get into whether you should count calories and all that stuff, but you know, for me, just j literally just two weeks ago, just starting this thing, I have lost so much belly fat and so much bloat. So my stomach does not stick out as much. Uh, it's actually, my stomach is actually more now, you know, looking, you know, in line with the rest of my body. So it's looking, looking good and stuff, good, looking good and all. So yeah. Intermittent fasting, you know, it's been working out well for me. Like I said, I did it a long time, well, when I was in college and it worked out well then. Uh, just, you know, just the hustle and bustle of life and you just kind of leave those things that aren't, that are, you know, that are, you know, 
you know, that are, it's, it's just easier to get out of the good habits sometimes and get into bad habits. And so I'm back at it. It's working well for me now. I, like I said, I only consume 3,000 calories a day. That might be, you know, not enough for some people. It might be too much for some people, but 3,000 calories works for me. And uh, just I'll continue to do that until, you know, I, I, if, you know, I happen to feel worse. So, yeah, so that's kind of kind of it, you know, for this vlog. Just, uh, yeah, this, 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 this vegetarian, vegan journey is, uh, is going well. You know, and at this point, I think I'm going to stick to being a vegetarian or pescatarian just because it works for me, you know, uh, at this point. So anyways, like, subscribe, comment, and uh, thanks for watching. Talk to you all later. Peace.